Amy fucking Schumer. <laughs> you know, that's all I can say. I've got no excuse for winging this. I was told about this several weeks ago. I haven't even got a piece of paper in my pocket and I'm gonna wing it anyway and I'm gonna pretend the teleprompters don't work. I don't know what to say about this. It's kind of amazing, um, the BAT Awards. The, I was at the BAT Awards once before and uh, my favorite moment was when a bank gave a massive check to a first time filmmaker. I love this awards. It's really the way things should go. Um, I don't know what to say except that um, I've been doing this for such a long time and I still don't know what I'm up to. I'm following my nose and the great news is that there are lots of other people who are up for having a laugh. And to go from Derek Jarman to Amy Schumer, um, things are going well, you know? <laughs> you wait till next year, by the way, everybody. Um, yeah, I started making films with one filmmaker, Derek Jarman. I worked with him for nine years. Um, on seven films, uh, very lazy, just plugging away with the same fam. And then he left the building kind of uh, unexpectedly 20 years ago, died, and um, I was high and dry. And the amazing thing was there were other people who were up for playing. And a lot of them came from this room, from this community. And I was an alien from a place called Scotchland which is an independent country, by the way. <laughs> it's just England that's not. Um, and uh, so many truly amazing people in this room, um, Tom, Bernard, and Michael Barker, and now my friends at Radius, Tom Quinn, extraordinarily independent-minded people and hearted people who are supporting filmmakers like Sally Potter, like Jim Jarmusch, like my friend Bong Joon-ho. And putting it out there, this feels for an alien like home. You're all a bunch of freaks and I'm a freak too. So we all do things in good company. Uh, my favorite thing is saying, see you tomorrow to my mates and in a working environment, it's the best. We all know that and uh, on we go. I learned a few things from Derek Jarman. One was uh, to get there early, be prepared to hold your own light, and don't expect to be paid. Uh, and that stood me in very good stead, and I advise you to take it to heart. Um, and the other was just to hang out with your friends and have as good a time as you can. Um, I'm so grateful. This really means a lot. This means that, uh, you know, making it up is not, you know, such a bad thing. Thank you so much. And the other thing to say is I know that the reason I'm here this year and not any other year is because of one man, uh, a man called Chris Lyons, who is a very great dental technician. Um, and the year before last, I rang him up four times to commission him to make four sets of teeth for uh, a vampire in Jim's film, Only Lovers Left Alive, um, for uh, Dr. Shrinkrom, the internet psychiatrist in uh, Terry Gilliam's Zero Theorem, for, uh, what was the other, and for Grand Budapest Hotel, Wes Anderson's uh, great film, and for Minister Mason for the great Bong Joon-ho. And he is great, jo uh, Chris Lyons, uh, he works for a company called Fangs FX, and I've got his number, so 